hello again. It's been a while. Sorry for the no uploads. I was in Los Angeles. I did cop a couple things and to tide you guys over, I'm gonna fill you guys in. Right here, I have a dad hat I bought from PacSun. It is so fucking straightforward. It's, it's a pineapple, if you couldn't tell. It, that, that's, that's a vegetable, if you didn't know. So let, let me show you this dank cool trick. Fuck. Let, let me show you this dank cool trick. I also got this, and it is a de de denim shirt. I'm trying to say denim shirt. It's a denim shirt from Top Man. Haven't seen this being sold over here. It probably is. It cost me fucking $70, the cunts. Right, I do apologize, because I am wearing jeans at the moment. And I'm not one to wear double denim. But you can't see my jeans, who gives a monkeys. This is what it looks like on. I thought it looked fucking sick at the time. Oh, jeez, look at me, I look like a fucking Canadian. <laughs> oh. What are you talking about? Oh, I don't actually know how can Canadians, can I can Canada people sound. But whatever, look, I think it's a sick fucking, I really like the embroidery. You can top button it if I'm not fat enough. Here we go. Oi oi, bang bang bang. Just need a bandana and I guess I'm uh, a gang banger. I suppose, I, I suppose I could do double denim, but I just would look like a fucking tremendous nonce. But on the back, you got the embroidery. Bang, bang. Look at this. And now to tell you a bit about Los Angeles. It's pretty good. It's colourful. On my first day there, I saw two proposals. One at Studio City, if you know where that is, and one at the Griffin Observatory. I saw two in one day. Studio Sissy's a bit shit. Universal was good. Really do a lot though. It was quick, it was only there for four days. I'm jet lagged to shit. In terms of future for this channel, um, it, I, I do this because I just enjoy it, simply put. I do it because it's a hobby, not necessarily a sense of duty or an obligation, so my sporadic uploads are only representative of the creativeness I'm feeling at the time. So in terms of where I'm gonna go, I'm not I'm not sure. I'm I'm not Oh fucking hell. I'm not gonna pull the wool over your eyes and inundate you with shit. What ah oh, fuck, this is so bright. I'm not going to inundate you with just stupid shit. I only want to give you guys value and shit worth uploading. I'm not going to waste your time. But, I will try and keep this consistent. Whether, you, whether you've been subscribed for since I converted this old bo bollocks into A1 Streetwear, or whether you're relatively new, you've probably seen a lot of fluctuation in my character as a whole. I do, I do feel like I'm still finding my footing. I don't, I don't really know what defines A1 Streetwear as a whole, whether this is just a character I play, or whether this is just kind of an extension of myself. Or in fact, it's fully representative of me, but I don't. But I don't see. I don't have a particular goal with this. I just, I just do it and let circumstance change it. So I would love if you guys just stay put and kind of hold on, almost. Just, just kind of stay with me, stay put, and we'll take it from here. We'll, we'll let. We'll let the natural course of things kind of dictate where to go. Anyway, my name is, in fact, A1 Streetwear. You have been tuned in, tuned in, tuned in for yet another episode. Papa bless.